In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create an entire PowerPoint presentation using ChatGPT. Let's get started. Microsoft recently announced Copilot, its AI-based assistant for Office 365. Among other things, it has the ability to automatically create PowerPoint presentations based on text input. But until we get a hands on that, here's how you can do the same using ChatGPT. I'll start by going to ChatGPT, which is available at chat.openai.com. Let's say I want to create a presentation on emotional intelligence. Let me type my query. I'm instructing ChatGPT to provide me with a visual basic code. I want you to write me VBA code for PowerPoint presentation on emotional intelligence. You are to fill in all the text and images and videos with your own knowledge, no placeholders. Ensure there is a call to action at the end. Provide references where possible. I need six slides. You can give as much information as you want to chat GPT so that it can create for you an output that matches your requirement. Let's see what chat GPT gives me. It starts generating the visual basic code. If the code is too long, ChatGPT will pause. All you need to do is click on this, continue generating. Once the code is generated, there are additional instructions for us that the file path in the code should be replaced with the actual path. Let me copy all the code starting from here till the beginning and press Ctrl C. This will copy the code to your clipboard. Next, let me open PowerPoint. Open a blank presentation and select this option developer. If you don't see this option developer, that is very easy to fix. Select file, scroll down till you find options, choose customize ribbon and on the right hand side scroll till you find this ribbon option developer. If it is not clicked, click on it and select OK. You should now have developer. Select the first icon on the toolbar which is called visual basic. Next. Choose the arrow till you see this drop down and select module. Make sure your cursor is in this blank area and press Ctrl V. This will copy the code that was created by ChatGPT. Before we see the magic happen, there are two things we need to do. The first is to get the right images. If I scroll through my code, I can see there are references to four images. Image 1, Image 2, image 3 and image 4. Try to get images that match your slide. In slide 2, we need an image that reflects our ability to recognize, understand and manage our own emotions. Let me go to Google image search and search for managing emotions. This looks like an interesting image. Let me right click and save this image on my PC. I will repeat this exercise for all the four images. Now that I have my four images, let me rename them for easier reference. This is image one, image two, image three, and image four. Just make sure that you are not breaking any copyright laws, especially if you are creating presentations for commercial use. Now I can switch to PowerPoint and replace this part with the right location and image name. In my case, it is in drive D. I will copy this and paste it here and replace this with image two, image three and image four. Now we are ready to see the magic. Click on this play button, click run, and we have a presentation automatically created for us. Let's enhance it a little bit. Click on design and then choose designer. Let's go with this theme. You can enter your name here. Go to the next slide. Choose one of the designs that looks good and repeat this exercise for the rest of the slides. And a PowerPoint is done. It is said that artificial intelligence will not replace humans, but humans who are using artificial intelligence will replace humans that don't. I think it is very important for us to understand these tools, learn them and use them for our benefit. Because if we don't, we will go to work one day and find that AI is doing our job.